Hi everyone. So yesterday we saw Rave lose twice to Pokerface and MVP. However, I'm pretty surprised at the lose to Pokerface. I don't know what Boogie was really thinking with that Spectre pick. I checked in our game about the 5 minute mark and he had something called lines of 3 CS. And by the 15 minute mark he was scaling just a tiny bit above the supports in that work. I do wish they would draft a more semi-carry hero to sort of do his playstyle, but, you know, whatever, I guess. <laughs> we'll have to see more games from Rave to see if they're going to play to their strength, or if they're going to continue to try new things. But for today, there's only one game, which is First Departure versus Arrow. It should be a tough game for both teams, though given how superbly First Departure is performing of late, I will be giving the advantage to them. Arrow has been going in and out with her playstyle since the loss of Johnny, and I think stability will be key in this game, given First of Archer's am amazing ability to play late with Miracle. For Arrow's side, we saw them go up against Invasion last night in the best of three, coming out on top 2-0. to zero. However, this was Invasion without Kachik, Ember, and Snow, though honestly I'm not sure if Snow is still in Invasion, I think he's just a sub now, and Arrow still had a tough time trying to win. Some of their win can even be contributed to bad choices by Invasion, rather than good play by Arrow. You can see how shaky they are in the moves at some points, and while DDZ is performing amazingly as always, uh, being the solo player of the team gives them a lot more freedom. The other three are sort of relying on MTR to follow their lead, or following the lead of MTR, which sort of shows a lack of stability. First Departure has had some strong wins on the other hand, and across the internet people are praising their fantastic drafting and play by all of First Departure. They are playing high impact and barely letting a second of the game drop out of their control. I think especially the two supports of First Departure, Lovey and Kai, have been just waiting for Miracle to return to them, as their play is especially tuned to him, given their routine for such a long time. While Scythe had its good points, I think their biggest weakness was the lack of support, especially that strong support combo like we see in First Departure, and the impact this had on Miracle's potential over the past week. All in all, I think this is First Departure series. It's a best of five, so I wouldn't be surprised if Arrow do pull a few tricks out of their sleeve and grab a game or two, but I strongly believe First Departure is going to continue their amazing play and take the series home. Either way, good luck, have fun, and see you tomorrow. Bye!